the New Times. At the headquarters of the Ministry of Education, the government signed a partnership with Microsoft Corporation for one digital ID per child. This is one of many other government ICT programs to improve the quality and the relevance of education and teaching system in partnership with different IT with companies, mostly Intel and Microsoft. Microsoft most comes in on how to use these devices and be able to access materials and also training of teachers. That's where the expertise comes in from Microsoft. That's what we have been discussing with them. In this new engagement of one digital ID per child, Microsoft will provide broadband connectivity and cloud storage called Office 365 Cloud, which will enable the interaction between students and teachers. So the connectivity to uh, 365 using the one identity um, it is a step um, forward versus just having a computer at home. We use our phones today to communicate. We use our phones to write. Uh, we use Word on phones. We use uh, PowerPoint on phone, Excel, uh, all of that. So we are very happy to support that. When you talk about the, the digital ID for all students, we're talking about using one of the Microsoft platforms and creating that digital space where the teacher is going to provide to student homework, where the student is going to be able to work, where the student is going to be able to have reading content, educational resources, and all that is within one of the platforms that Microsoft has called Office 365. And we are still developing and closing quickly on, on how that's going to work through the master plan that we are working on. The government's seven years target is that in 2017, 30% of students from primary and secondary schools should be able to use ICT in education and 50% at the university level. But we believe with the help of our friends, Microsoft, we should be able to go beyond that, especially using the modern technology of one identity per child. Uh, in addition to that, and still as part of that legal framework, we are also working on connectivity. Uh, there's a lot of opportunities, a lot of advanced research that Microsoft is working on, on how we can reduce the cost of connectivity within the educational space. Since 2010, the government and partners have distributed 204,000 computers as one laptop per child, and the program has been an example to many other countries.